here. I have a fun little unboxing for you guys today. I just received my second Stitch Fix box. I got my first one back in December, but it literally came two days before Christmas, so I didn't have a chance to do a recording or show you guys anything that I got with that box. But I had a really good first experience. I love the way that they styled me, so I want to go ahead and continue to do it and show you guys what I got this month in my box. Sorry if the lighting is absolutely horrible. It's overcast and it's raining here today and I've probably picked like the worst spot ever to record this video in but I wanted to make sure and show you guys what I got and I'm dying to see so I couldn't wait any longer so it is what it is but those of you that don't know what stitch fix is it is a style box so basically you fill out a questionnaire of all of your style and your sizes what you like what you don't like you can actually link up your instagram or facebook or pinterest or places like that that your stylist that you get assigned to will actually look at to get kind of a good feel of your style and they send you five pieces a month or you could do it weekly or bi-monthly or however you want to do it but it's five pieces per box and you can pick and choose what you want from the box and purchase those items and then send back the ones that you don't like and then there's a little bit of a discount if you end up keeping all five items so that's kind of stitch fix in a nutshell but like I said I'm kind of new to it so this is only my second box but I want to go ahead and show you guys what came in my particular box the only thing that I told them when selecting um, different things for this month as far as telling them what I liked and didn't like I told them I didn't want any accessories and I didn't want any dresses this time so crossing my fingers that I have a couple of tops in there because I was kind of itching for some new shirts so this is the box that it comes in. I don't know if you guys can see it there in the camera, but it's a nice big box. And right there on top, when you open it up, you have your packaging that you send back the items that you don't want. And then you have a little envelope that comes from your stylist. And on here, it just has the um, items that they have chosen for you, which are right here. I don't wanna look at too much until I open up the box. And then they just write you a little note on here. Mine says, or, hi Ashley, happy Stitch Fix. I hope you had a happy new year and so much fun styling your second fixed. I reviewed your Pinterest board. I love your style. I noticed that you pinned a few striped shirts, so I'm sending you a couple in this fix. Yay, happy for that. And then she goes on and talks about some of the brands of some of the things that she sent. And then also in this envelope is your prices. So it'll have like the price for everything in here as well, which we can look at at the very end together. So. I'll go ahead and show you guys what I got. Right here on top, it looks like I got a pretty purple shirt. It's it's a really pretty color. I like it, but I'm not sh exactly sure if it's my style. It's made by Skies Are Blue is the brand. So this is kind of what it looks like. It has this really pretty detailing around the neckline, if you guys can see that there. And then the sleeves are buttoned up. So they're kind of like a three quarter length, I guess. And then it looks like it's pretty loose fitting here at the bottom, which I also like. So first impressions of this one, kind of on the fence, unless it looks amazing on, probably won't go with it just because I'm not sure that it's completely my style, but it's pretty for sure. So I'm excited to try it on. And then, oh, then she sent me, it looks like this gray shirt. This is made by Paper Moon is the company and it's super cute. First impressions, I love this. It's like a gray and cream scoop neck and it almost feels like there's like a spandex kind of cotton material, but on the side, it has this really pretty lace detailing which i think is going to be really flattering on definitely cute i'm excited to see the way that it fits and like kind of how the cut is on my body but it's a little bit looser at the bottom again i don't know if you guys can even see in the camera but um it looks to be a little bit more form-fitting than the other one but still um not like super tight for sure so i think it'll be cute on I'm excited about this one so far and then another striped one um this is a navy cream shirt and it looks like it has those uh like bat wings if i'm saying it right they're kind of like where it's tighter in the arms but then it gets baggier like underneath your arm and i'm not sure how far down it will come on my arm again i have to try it on but it looks like maybe like a three quarter length um on your arm and another scoop neck and then it's a little bit baggier there at the bottom i'm not even sure if you guys can see it but it's baggier there this one is super cute too my favorite still so far is the the gray and the cream, but I do like this navy stripe a lot too. Both of these are a little bit more my style, I think, than that purple one. Um, and then she also sent me a pair of jeans, which is super fun. I'm kind of picky with my jeans. Um, 
I do like the wash on these actually in the front. You guys can see kind of like, it's like a dark jean with the wash. They're bootlegged at the bottom. The company is, oh, let me see here if I can find it. Um, Stevie, cut from the cloth. It looks like Stevie maybe is the style. Straight leg petite jean. So, um, so yeah, I'm excited to try these on. I'm not sure about them. Unless they're like super duper amazing, um, I probably won't keep them just because I tend to have a lot of dark jeans already. But with that being said, I guess I like dark jeans since I have a lot of them. So we'll see with those. And then the last item she sent looks like a handbag. First impressions, I'm not sure I love the color. I don't know if the camera is going to do this justice for you guys because it is kind of like a true red color, but it might look a little orangey in the camera because the lighting super sucks right now. But it has this zipper here in the back, and then it has a little magnetic closure here. The print on the inside is really cute. It's like a black and white kind of geometric stripe, I guess, a little bit. But, um, yeah, I'm not sure. Like, I'm definitely the bag lady. Those You guys know that. But I'm just not sure that this exact one is my style. So I'll probably be sending this back. But I think it's super fun that I got a bag in this particular fix because it's always neat to see new ones. But so just to recap, I got the bag and the pair of dark jeans and these super cute tops, which I'm excited about most, this navy and cream one, and then the um, gray and cream with the lace on the side, and then this purple one. So that's kind of my second stitch fix box. Oh, let me tell you guys the prices really quick. Those of you that are wondering about that. So the prices, this could go ahead and like determine what I buy right off the bat. So <laughs> um, the red bag was 58, so definitely not going to keep that one. The navy um, jeans, the cut from the cloth jeans are 88. So again, kind of on the expensive side, I think for jeans, but if they fit completely amazing, then possibility. Um, the Paper Moon Beverly Lace Side Panel Knit Top. That's the gray one with the lace on the side. That one's 54. And then the other one, that navy striped one, is 48. So both of those, if they fit super cute on, I will probably be keeping. And then the Skies Are Blue, um, the Jewel Tone Purple Scoop Neck Blouse. That one's 58. So again, all three of the tops I'm kind of on the fence with. Um, I got to see how they fit and see which ones I go with. I would love to hear in the comments below which one of these you guys like kind of first impressions. I know it's hard to tell because you can't see them on my body, but if you guys have a favorite right off the bat, I'd love to hear down at the bottom. And then I will also put in the description box my Stitch Fix referral link. I'm not sure how that works. I think I get something and you guys get something um, as far as like a referral if you shop Stitch Fix through my link, but um, I'll put that down there for those of you that are interested. And I definitely recommend trying Stitch Fix. Like I said, this is my second box. It's super fun. It's a way to get clothes that you normally wouldn't probably try on in the store. So it's something different and I look forward to it every month. But I'll let you guys know in my Instagram which ones I decide to keep. I'll like try to post a picture of me in maybe the outfit or two that I decide to keep. So I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you have a fantastic weekend and I'll talk to you next week. Bye.